welcome to 5 minute solution channel in this video i'm going to show you guys how you can give uh, access to your google account uh, to third party apps so for granting access first you will like uh, uh, you will like understand that uh, in some cases uh, it will ask for you to like give access for example uh, these extensions uh, this extension need uh, Google account uh, access or in some cases some other apps might need when they do you have to like uh, just uh, give them the permission by simply clicking give permission or accept something like that I'm gonna show you how that process works so I have added our extension which requires uh, to give uh, Google account permission so this extension actually works with Gmail so when I'm going into Gmail it is asking me for a uh, like permission it will ask me for a permission so when I click activate so it says that sign in with Google and it says choose an account to continue to part through so whenever uh, an app will require or an extension will require access to Google account it will always like show their logo in here and it will also like show a text here to continue to example service in this case the example service is Patro then you have to like just uh, click on your Google account if you are currently logged in and if you are not currently logged in you will like find the option to like put username and comment and if you want to use another account then you have to click on use another account so I'm gonna simply click on my account which I'm currently using so once I'm gonna uh, click on that the like process is done I don't have to do anything else it uh, that account will be activated uh, I mean that app will uh, get access to my Google account so that's how you basically grant an access to uh, like app to your Google account and you can simply remove that access as well from going into manage your Google account settings and going into data and pri privacy and here you will find uh, let me browse more uh, apps and services and third-party apps with account access so from here you can like click and click on app and click on remove access so that's how you basically grant access to an app to your gmail account or your google account so if you want more videos like this then like comment and subscribe and also thank you very much for watching this video